Sana is stalking his sister who's lying in the grass and we are live from South Africa. Oh, he's still on a thorn. Now you can see there's two leopards there and uh, they are going to hopefully be really playful on this cool, misty, rainy morning. My name is Brent Leosmith. I have my very good friend who's got a cool cat thumb for today. He's wearing sunglasses even though there's not a bit of sun in sight. Together, Brent and Brian, my incredible cameraman, are known as the Killer Bees. And we have wonderful little leopard cubs. And what are they up to now? Now, we are right in the bottom of a river system where there is a slightly bad signal. And with the rain this morning, it might cause a little bit of havoc. So there might be some pixelation, but it's worth it to see these incredible cats living wild and free. Oh, it's games time. The <laughs> This cool weather brings out the best in the little cats. Look how little Hasana is crouching, he's bawling his muscles, getting ready to pounce towards his sister. Now, mom's not here. She's out hunting. It's been really great hunting weather for her last night. Some wind, some rain, some dark skies. So at any moment, she might arrive and lead them off to a kill. Isn't this exciting? Oh, here he comes, straight towards us. <laughs> oh, the tables are turned. Shongile is now on the prowl, looking through the little thicket. Look, look how she's balling her muscles. She's getting ready. There. Oh, she's got him. <laughs> you can see the massive size difference between them. Uh, they're exactly the same age. They're from the same litter. Oh, tables are turned again. Whoever turns their back is, is the victim. Look, there we go. He's getting ready to pounce. Boom! <laughs> oh, wonderful. Now, all this jumping and chasing and cavorting about is really, really important. It's how they hone their hunting skills. So those hunting skills are instinctive, uh, but this is how they hone them, by playing with each other. Now, if anyone wants to ask a question on these incredible cats, remember, hashtag Safari Live on Twitter is the best way to get hold of us. The only way to get hold of us. I would love to hear from you. Uh, it is wonderful getting to interact and teach you a little bit about our home that we're so passionate about. Now, they've just gone. Oh, they're coming back through. Tumble. Now we're getting to see these two cubs together and Chelsea is wondering how long will they stay together? Chelsea, not for too much longer. Sort of in the next three or four months they're going to split. Normally little females will become independent of their mother at around 16 to 18 months. And so they're just over 12 months, sometimes a bit younger and the males will stay a little bit longer. They are mostly solitary, so it is always incredibly special to spend time with leopards. And normally you only see one of them, so seeing two is always better. Now, of course, leopards have been the stars of the Safari Live series, but they're not the only big cat out here. So I know Jamie is hot on the tracks of the Inkahuma Pride of Lions. So let's go see where she's searching. <laughs> 